would you say has made you successful? You know, it's funny. I don't necessarily think of myself as successful. I just th I think about myself as being really happy and fulfilled by what I do. And I guess if, if success comes with that, then that's a really nice consequence. But, I mean, for me, it, the first thing it starts with is just really being passionate about what I do and really waking up every morning and thinking about how can I make you know, the employees I work with, the company I work for, and the world really a better place. The second thing that's helped me at least get to where I am today is I've never stopped learning. I've always tried to master my craft. And for me, it's that congruence between being a learning professional and being a person who continues to learn and never rests in my laurels. I think the, the last thing would be that you know, I just think of myself, again, back to that example of when I was a frontline employee, I think of myself through the eyes of the employee. I often think about, even though I have kind of a really nice office and a big title, um, I'm just like everyone else. I put my pants on the same way. And I have my own, you know, challenges and I have my own concerns about things. And, I, and I've had, you know, some good success. So I try to just keep it all in perspective. And I think my wife, uh, Lisa, really helps me do that and she keeps me grounded. Um, you know, I get to be the boss at work, she's the boss at home. Uh, she doesn't let me forget that, which is really good. But I think it's those three things.